Yeah, my name is Helena. I come from University of Copenhagen and now I'm studying as an Erasmus student in Wageningen University. I got accepted here in the spring and after a few months I got a mail from the university uh, offering me accommodation here. Uh, and in general, university has been really helpful with everything, with guides on how to register at municipality and guides of how to get around the university and with the housing and everything. So, so coming here has been really easy, especially as a, as a Danish student, uh, since the Dutch culture is not that different. So Wageningen has uh, quickly become my home away from home. Uh, what is special about studying in Wageningen is the international community of the city and also that it's kind of a small city but everything in Wageningen is designed for students. I really like uh, how all the uh, classes are built up. It's both an interactive classroom and lectures and a lot of lab work and you're on the same level as the professors so there's no uh, problems with ever asking questions or contacting them directly. The structure of uh, the lectures and the classrooms are really similar between Wageningen and the University of Copenhagen, so that's really nice. Since we're so many students, there's a lot of uh, opportunities for doing different kind of sports and stuff, and also doing different kind of classes. Like I'm doing a Dutch for Beginners class. I chose to study food science and technology because it's, for me it's a very exciting uh, field. There's always new things going on and there's always new things to discover, so it's never boring. I'm specializing in the field of fermentation and microbiology. Uh, I really like that because it's a rapidly developing field and I think people are really starting to open their eyes for all the possibilities there is within fermentation science. My dream is to work uh, either at a university or at a company in some sort of research and development. That would be really nice. One of the big differences between studying in Wageningen and Copenhagen is that Copenhagen is a capital and therefore a big city, whereas Wageningen is more of a small city. Uh, the good thing here is that you always meet people you know everywhere. So. Uh, so that's really nice, whereas uh, in Copenhagen maybe you get more of a, of a nightlife and big city life. But uh, I don't think Wageningen is boring or a sleepy town because of that, because we're so many students, so we make it our own. Hope I'd see you in Wageningen.